Hey guys, Purely Awesome Cuber here, and today I will be showing you how to solve the second layer of the 3x3 Rubik's Cube. So in the last two episodes, we covered how to solve the first layer by so first solving the edges, and then the corners. Now, we're to the part where you will flip the cube over so white is on the bottom and yellow, the yellow center, is on top. Now you're going to be looking for the four edges that go in these four spots. So there will be uh, like a lot of different cases you can have for this, but it's not too overwhelming. Uh, once we finish the first layer, now the second layer. So we're not worrying about white at all now. All the white pieces are solved correctly. So what you want to do now is find the middle layer edge. So you first want to look on the top layer at those four edges. So ooh, I found the uh, blue and red one. Right? And the way you know if it's a middle layer edge is if it doesn't have yellow on it. So I found blue and red, right? So what you want to do with this is you want to turn the top layer until the front color, right? Not the color on top, which is red. The front color of this, in my case blue, matches its center. So I turn it to match blue, and now red is on the right side, right? That's important. The red color, which is on top, the red center is on the right side of it, not the left side. So the algorithm for when the color on top, its center, is on the right side is U, R, U prime, R prime. U prime, F prime, U, F. So again, that's U, R, U prime, R prime, U prime, F, U, or sorry, that was an F prime, then U, F. Right, so now we have the other case that you could have, which is when the um, the thing, the the color on top, right? Says this is matched with red now, right? Same edge. I'm just showing you the different case. So now red is matching with its center, and blue, the color on top, is on the left side. So the algorithm for this is U prime, L prime, U, L, U, F, U prime. F prime. So that would solve both cases whether uh, the edge is matching with the color and the color on top is on the right side or the edge is matching the front center and the color on top is on the right side. So that is how you solve those two cases. Then there are some other cases. Uh, here we have this edge, right? Now there's this case where this edge is in the right spot between the orange and green centers except it's flipped right so this isn't matching right so what you want to do with this case is do either algorithm twice and I'll show you what I mean right so let's pick the first one that we did which is the color on top its center would be on the right side so we want to hold the cube facing like this with the other color on the right side and do that algorithm U R U prime R prime U prime F prime U F now the edge has been brought to the top layer it's over here right so now you uh, place it in like it's any old edge like the other ones right you just match it up with its center the color on top is on the right and you just do the opposite Right, so that's how you solve it if it's flipped. And there's one other case you can have, which is the edge is in the spot, but it's in the wrong spot. Right, and let's say um, this edge would be in here. Right, so these two edges they need to switch and flip. So what you want to do? Just pick one of them. 
And with the cube facing you, right, let's say I pick the left one, right? So if it's on the left side, you do the one with the color on top and the center on the left side, right? You do that algorithm, which is u prime, l prime, u, l, u, f, u prime, f prime, right? So now it's taking the edge out. Now you match the front color up with the center and just insert it in the other spot like normal, right? So you just, oh, this needs to go to the right side. So you do u, r, u prime, r prime, u, f prime, u, or u, f, uh, sorry. So now that's in place, and while you're putting it in, it bumps the other one out, and then you just put that one in. So that is how you solve all the cases you can have with that uh, second layer. And we'll be moving on to the final layer next time. Bye.